Well, young people from all over Ireland are going to come to us, um, both filmmakers and animators. And this year we've got 29 filmmakers from all over Ireland coming to produce four short films over the period of 10 days. Three days of the camp are all training sessions with uh, our mentors in the various areas of um, camera, lighting, sound, screenwriting, um, storyboarding, music production, all the separate areas um, throughout the first three days. And just done two workshops. I think there was 14 in the first group and a little more in the second. So it's nice intimate sized groups and everyone gets a go, gets a hands-on go at performing and recording. Uh, they have three days of film shoots where they crew the entire production themselves. They are the directors, they are the lighting team, they are the camera team, sound team and so on. They deal directly with the actors, they're the ones recording everything. It's a great experience, my first time ever being director. Um, I'm not that experienced in film at all, so this cat, like, I've learned so much today. So it's really giving me a sense of what, if I chose to be a director as a career, or even working on a film set, really like what it would be like if I was to do it every day. And then the final three days of the camp are post-production, so they edit the whole film, do a sound mix, layer in music, record their own sound effects and music, uh, until at the end of the week they have pretty much a finished product from start to finish. I found it really enjoyable, I've made some new friends, got a real new and kind of fresh perspective on filmmaking, one that I didn't have before. Um, I suppose the knowledge that I've gained even just from the nine days I've had here so far is just unbelievable to be honest and I really wouldn't have found myself looking for it unless it hadn't been for like you know my youth worker in my school. It's only I suppose in recent years that um, filmmaking has been considered an art form in a sense and it's great to see that it's on the curriculum now and uh, young people are able to learn all the skills associated with filmmaking because it's also an industry. This year, the National Youth Film School is ramping up once again. We're introducing animation. We have 16 young people from all over Ireland. It's a hugely successful programme, and the feedback has been great so far. We'll start out with like, planning what we're going to do and bringing that along until we get to shooting, and then you'll finish the day with a finished product. The week has been really, really good, quite intensive. With, uh, we've been learning how to do hand-drawn animation and like we did sand animation yesterday and we're doing claymation today. My artistic vision is different in that sense now that I know to listen to other people and get their ideas because you'll end up making a, an idea that's greater than the sum of both ideas on their own. I made loads of friends, uh, that was really fun. Um, and I made loads of like kind of developing connections animation wise like I get to hang out with all these people and I get to learn off them and everything and Paper Panther was amazing and they taught us so much. So a lot of young people who come to us are looking at a, you know a, maybe a career placement or, or a college placement in film or animation and what this does is it kind of condenses a huge amount of learning a foundational learning for them to go forward and produce a lovely portfolio that they can present um, possibly along with young people that they will find and meet here at the National Youth Film School um, produce work and then put that work forward as a portfolio either as a college portfolio or you know use it for um, entering the industry. It's the art of storytelling and uh, kind of so it's like another thing. and to see another generation coming through with stories to tell it's just fantastic.